Greetings, adventurers, and welcome back to our journey through the mystical realms of Last Epoch. Today, we're delving deep into the art of crafting, using rare materials such as Etera's Blessing and Dragon's Tear. So ready your hammers and sharpen your minds as we learn how to forge legendary items like the Hammer of Eternity and the Shield of Ages. Now let's embark on this crafting odyssey together. Crafting in Last Epoch is more than just combining materials. It's a complex system that can elevate your gear to legendary status. But fret not, fellow travellers, for we are here to guide you through every step of the way. First things first, let's familiarise ourselves with the crafting interface. Here you'll find a plethora of options to customise your gear to suit your playstyle. From affixes to runes, the possibilities are endless. But before you can embark on your crafting adventure, you'll need materials. Whether it's ores mined from the depths of Etera or rare essences harvested from formidable foes, gather as many resources as you can to fuel your crafting endeavours. Now, let's talk about affixes. These are the bread and butter of crafting in Last Epoch. By adding affixes to your gear, you can enhance its properties, granting bonuses to everything from damage to survivability. But be warned, crafting isn't without its risks. Each attempt has a chance of success or failure, and failure can result in the loss of your precious materials. Choose your actions wisely, and may fortune favour the bold. To increase your chances of success, there are a few tricks you can employ. Utilise crafting modifiers, experiment with different combinations, and don't be afraid to take calculated risks. Remember, fortune favours the prepared mind. And there you have it, fellow travellers, our comprehensive guide to crafting in Last Epoch. With patience, perseverance and a dash of luck, you too can become a master crafter. So go forth, explore the depths of Etera and forge your own destiny.